guys welcome back to my channel thank you for subscribing and liking this video it's wednesday today and i'm super excited because we have a holiday so today we are not going to work uh when we have a holiday at least sometimes i get free time to do my personal things so for today i want to go and make my hair my hair is a little bit untidy so i'm going to the salon i'm even late it's almost uh, 11 30 and then after that i want to go check out some airbnb spaces uh, I, I have some visitors coming in the Eldoret and I would just love them to have their own personal spaces. So I'm going to check out some Airbnb. Uh, there are two that I've located and um, there's one specific one that I've really liked. I'm going to post the video uh, of, the, of the Airbnb here. You can also check them out if you like the space. And then what else am I doing today? Yeah, as the days goes by, as the day goes by, I'm going to be updating you guys. So yeah, let me go make my hair and I'll see you later. Bye. If you don't mentor, you can't go on vacation. It's that simple. You are so selfish, so self-possessed, so insecure. You can't even go on vacation. Why? You don't trust no one to be in your pulpit, pastor. <laughs> You're sick. Great leaders love to give up power. They love to watch their protégés exceed them. We need history more than money. Ladies and gentlemen, we need leaders who are more interested in people than in private ambition. This is my ministry. This is my position. This is my company. This is my anointing. This is my, my, my. These are sick people. These are not leaders. These are parasites. They are sucking the blood out of the people's trust to build their own personal ambition. Leadership is not about your ambition. It's about the people receiving what is rightfully theirs. Hey guys, I'm already back. It's almost 7 p.m. And at least today, the holiday really gave me ample time to do my own personal things thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys liked the airbnb i'm gonna put her her phone number on the video or on the description box and guys let me tell you guys is my face glowing i've been there are some products that i've been using i wanna um let me see if I can plug you guys. I really used to have bad acne, like bad acne. I tried everything. But one thing that really helped me, I cut on dairy and uh, a lot of um, red meat. So my sister put me on some products. This one, CeraVe. Man, this product is worth it. It's worth every penny. I've been looking for something that is a little bit mild, no scent on my face. CeraVe really works well for me. I have extremely sensitive, a sensitive, my skin is extremely sensitive because I have eczema. So when I eat anything, it shows on my face. When I apply something harsh, it shows on my face. As you can see right now, I'm not having anything on, but you can see the small, the dark spots to, to show you that I really used to have bad acne but this one works for my face and I also use the St. Ives blackhead scrub but I use this one like once or twice in a week to just take off the dead skin and the, and the blackheads uh, let me show you my secret my secret moisturizer you guys will not believe this eldoret climate the eldoret weather can be a little bit harsh at times it's extre extremely hot and dry sometimes it can also be extremely cold and dry at the same time 
so your skin tends to to be dry most of the time which uh makes the eczema it's a catalyst for eczema dry skin is like you're activating the eczema enzymes i don't know if that makes sense i'm not a dermatologist that's my own thinking but guys you see this tropical coconut oil hiki tuni dawa i don't know how but i've been able to see, like my face has really really changed those who know me personally can really testify like my face has changed i used to have bad acne and then dark under eyes i bought all types of serums bought all types of coconut butter shea but all those things never worked for me toners cleansers they never worked for me but a friend of mine just told me since your your skin is extremely sensitive just try the simple coconut oil and see how it reacts with your skin so i applied this for the for the first month i applied this it was so harsh like i could feel sores in my under eyes sores where my eczema was where the acne was but she told me to continuously using it for six months and then i will see change after six months it's been one and a half years i think that's 18 months and i can bet i'm no longer buying anything but using this on my face morning and evening period and that's on period anyway guys thank you guys for watching this video i'm showing you some of my secrets anyway thank you guys for watching this video thank you for coming to the end of the video and sure that you remember to have a pure heart pray for your for for your heart each day check your heart each day and i love you i'll see you in the next one bye don't forget to subscribe like, and share the video see you bye guys